Is it just me or is that sound of opening up packaging really satisfying? Anyway, in this video I'm going to be unboxing the iPhone 12 Pro Max in graphite. It was officially released today and I'm super excited to see it in person. And there's that satisfying unboxing sound again. And there it is, the graphite model. I love grey so I'm a big fan of this colour. I'll compare it with the Pacific Blue a little later in this video but first let's take a moment to admire it. Oh actually but first let's get this off. It's a real beauty and that's all down to its boxy shape and of course the colour too. It's subtle but beautiful. It's definitely a bigger iPhone 5 which I'm really happy about because the 5 has always been my favourite iPhone to date in terms of the design. So I'm glad that's been integrated into the 12. As you can see the sides are definitely going to be catching a lot of fingerprints but it looks sleek still. And you'll probably have noticed that the SIM ejector has now been moved to the left side leaving the power button on its own. It feels really good in the hand too and I said this in my last video about the iPhone 12 Pro but the new boxy design really makes it feel a lot more grippy so you can be sure that you'll have a good grip of it. And you no longer have to lean your phone against something or hold it when you're on a video call thanks to the flat bottom which makes the iPhone 12 Pro Max stand perfectly still on a flat surface. It's the small things. And yet yeah, there's still no USB-C on the iPhone so you can still use your old iPhone charger. The box only comes with a USB-C cable so if you want to use it you'll need to source your own USB-C power adapter. But as I said you can still use your old iPhone charger because the 12 Pro Max is still rocking that lightning port. The box also comes with a SIM ejector, a bit of info and the traditional Apple sticker. Only one though as opposed to the usual two because Apple will be cutting back. And that's the iPhone 12 Pro unboxed but the video doesn't end just yet. Let's take a look at the graphite colour on the 12 Pro Max side by side with the Pacific Blue on the iPhone 12 Pro. When Apple had made the announcement I was set on Pacific Blue, I mean I was waiting for a blue colour since like last year. But when I saw them in the Apple store I was kind of torn between the two, although I was leaning more towards graphite and I definitely prefer it. The blue is so so nice but I feel like for the long term graphite will probably suit me better as I feel like the love for the blue will wear off with time. Whereas I think the graphite is definitely a safer colour. What about you guys? Let me know your preference in the comments below and as always, thanks for watching.